One alpha one mark. Two alpha one. Three alpha one mark. Four alpha one mark. Most people thought it was a five alpha one mark. No one had done this before. Okay. Um, I think crate and prep is really um, just amazing. I when I first came here and I just see the, all the opportunity. Hey, I, I wrote this letter for you and I would love for you to read it out loud. Thank you very much. Dear Senora Fisher, the individuals that we meet on a daily basis help shape our learning journey as we navigate our way through our educational experiences. Teachers have the ability to be some of the most impactful individuals on this journey. Senora Fisher, I want to take this opportunity to thank you for making my first two years at PrEP a great experience. You are instrumental in providing a positive learning environment and pushing me to work hard and to be successful in Spanish. I appreciate you go out of your way to just check up on me and see how I am doing. You ask about my classes. You ask about how my cross country season is going. You care about how I am doing as a student and as an individual. It has been great having you as part of my prep learning journey. Thank you for always being there for me, Jacob. Thank you, Jacob. This is why I'm in teaching, to impact others' lives. Um, oh, there's many things that uh, set Crate and Prep apart. Um, some of the things that I think would be... Oh, hey, Antonio, how are you doing? Good, how are you? Good. I letter for you to read. Oh, thank you. All right, dear Mr. Poskichil, coming into freshman year, I didn't know how to feel about a new chapter in my life. I was scared, I didn't know what to expect. Coming into your class every day, I knew I was welcomed by you. You made jokes with our class, uh, made us laugh a lot, and it was overall a great environment for kids starting a new chapter. Many of us felt overwhelmed on homework and tests, and you taught us in a more relaxed way in which many of us enjoyed. I know I can come and talk to you if I ever need anything, and I'm very grateful I can count on you. I am thankful for having you freshman year as one of the most welcoming teachers I had, Antonio Vargas. Thank you, I appreciate that. Now, are you surprised by having the Antonio? Very surprised, yeah. I was not expecting him uh, at all. So, um, yeah, that really, really means a lot. Thank you. We have, well, let me preface. This, it's the students, absolutely, but I think for sure it's, we have a lot of blanks, Emma. What's up, folks? How are you doing, buddy? I'm good. Uh, living the dream. Are you going you gonna to stay awake for this? Oh, I'm trying. Okay. Wow. Um, Could we get you to read that out loud? Absolutely. Try not to tear up. That's gonna, I got my makeup on, man. I Me just, too. Okay. <laughs> All right, to Coach Stessman. I'm writing this letter to thank you for everything uh, from the basketball court to the classroom. I wanna thank you for being a great role model to me when I needed it most. Coming into junior year, I didn't know if I wanted to play basketball anymore. I don't know why that would be. But it was you who pushed me to keep playing and get better. I'm especially thankful for the memories made over the years. You've been the greatest influence on me here at PrEP, and I'm grateful for that. So with all that being said, I want to say thank you. Sincerely, Langston Parmar. That means the world to me, man. I absolutely loved our time together last year. You know, um, believe me, like, you're, you're one of my favorites, and you're a great kid, and doesn't have to stop here. So if you ever need anything, I appreciate this, though. It's, uh, it's a, it's a wonderful gift. Appreciate it, man. Of course. Thank you, sir. Now that you have been here, what do you feel sets Creighton Prep apart? Um, especially as it pertains to like maybe the students. Yeah. Uh, the mission. Oh, hi, Lou. Yes, Sarah. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm great. Uh, what I say about this, an exemplar student. Absolutely, one of my favorites. Okay. I have this letter here for you that I wrote, and uh, I'd love to read it. Oh boy. 
This is Tabor. I want to start off this letter by thanking you for being not only a teacher, but a mentor, as well as a catalyst for me to begin a deeper level of thinking. Your class and unique teaching style allowed me to learn more about myself and my morals, as well as helping me feel included and valued in your class. I'll never forget the presentation we did as freshmen about our favorite things and helped, how you helped me realize that I had more to offer by being my authentic self than I did trying to fit in with others. You have helped shape me into the person I am today and you have taught me lessons that I will carry with me into the future. I'm extremely grateful for you, for the incredible work you put in as a teacher, and for the care and belief you had in me. Look up to this. Um, yeah, this does come as a surprise. Mind, body, spirit, that's really how we learn. We learn best, and I can do that here. Hi, Mrs. Snake. So part of this is Hi. we got to choose a teacher to write a letter to. So I wrote you a letter. So uh, if you could read that, that'd be awesome. I'm going to read it right now? Yeah. OK, thank you. Yeah. So it says, is it going to make me cry? Probably. <sighs> Great. Dear Mrs. Hake, I want to start with the biggest thank you possible. When I walked into Academic Decathlon the first day of freshman year, masked up and nervous, I immediately felt at home with your pure love for teaching and joy to see your students succeed. Academic Decathlon, especially the sections you taught, thank you, kept me uh, coming to school during that weird hybrid year and reinstilled a love for school that I haven't felt since kindergarten. Through it all, you kept the spirit of the classroom bright and vivacious and without fail made school fun. Thanks again for all the ways you've impacted my life I can't say it enough, so I'll just say it one more time. Thank you. Thank you, Mark. Thanks, Mrs. Hayes. Really sweet. Thank you. Thank you. They should have told me this was going to happen. <laughs> <laughs> I think that is beautiful, and I mean, that's this is why I teach.